If you want to create a virtual audio connection inside your Mac OS, there is a really nice software for doing this, which is called Soundflower. Just go to the provided link in the video description, scroll down and then download the DMG file to install Soundflower. Once you've got Soundflower installed, um, go to your preferences, Enabled and Live, go to the audio menu and then you can pick Soundflower as an input or as an output. You have the option to choose Soundflower with two channels or Soundflower with even up to 64 channels. In my case, I want to receive via Soundflower the sound from a different software, so I have to select Soundflower as an input in Ableton. I now have to set the right settings in my audio software, in my sending audio software, in my case that's sensory percussion. So I go to the audio settings and the output from this software goes to the Soundflower 2 channel. And now the audio is being sent from sensory percussion to Soundflower and is being received inside of Ableton via the Soundflower. For our purposes as drummers, I have to say that um, the internal audio routing might not be a good solution because you will work with a lot of latency. So if we're going to have a look here and we um, select one audio input in uh, Ableton, So the sound is being sent now from uh, sensory percussion to Ableton. And the latency is alright if you just program stuff, but if you really want to play, um, you need a really, really good computer to make this work.